All right. Damn, YouTube fam. Sakara Hot here coming to y'all with another Orlando vlog today. Shit, be on finna head over here to AM Expo for day two. I only got like a little over an hour I can be there, man. The demo I'm going for the demo rides and stuff. The demo rides don't start till nine. It's like um it's like eight twenty or eight thirty something right now. Yeah, even yesterday my damn key did this dumb shit. I, like I don't wanna fucking turn. The fuck? My dumb man. Yep. Head over here, see if I can get in one or maybe two demo rides real quick. Yeah. Then me and my wife gotta check out, get on the road, and head back home. And damn, man, I must say, this is the most I've ridden my motorcycle in a single fucking weekend, man. If you consider uh, everything I've done this weekend, from riding up to Orlando from my house that's 179 to 180 miles there it's a round trip I'm already over 300 miles that's what 360 miles yeah 360 miles round trip and then the ride I've done while I'm up here from uh going over the standard motorcycle code to meet up with sub D everyone else to ride out and stuff to the riding around I just did in general yesterday while I was here hanging out with all guys and stuff man it's just it's been a crazy weekend it's been a lot of fun though got up early had breakfast with the wife now like i said you take my ass back name next week man i gotta get in at least one demo ride man i have to have to have to have to have to you have to fucking stop bitch yeah i have no idea how many miles i got on my bike for the weekend total because um, i never checked my uh my mileage before I left the house. If anything, I'll check my mileage on the way back home to see what happens from there. But yeah, this, me and my wife, we will definitely be coming up here to Orlando again in the near future to uh, spend time, just me and her come up here to spend time together. I might not do any vlogging or anything because chances are I won't have my motorcycle with me. But should I definitely be uh, recording some things, we'll do a little life vlog. Well, I'll do a little life vlog while we're up here. By that time, our son may be born. He may not be born. We don't, we don't know yet, but we do know that we're going to come back up here. Because, think about it, man. I paid in advance for the hotel we got. And since I paid in advance, I paid like a month in advance, man. We got the room for $108 for the weekend. Three days and two nights, 108 bucks. What the hell you going to get that at? And it's at a four-star hotel. We ain't at no, like no goddamn rundown ass motel with all your damn roaches and low grade appliances and stuff. No, son. We were at a four star hotel. Um, we got a microwave, refrigerator, bathroom, of course. We got a king size bed because we only need one bed for the both of us. Uh, we got a TV. We got a desk. We got Wi-Fi. Uh, it has a, of course, like any hotel, motel and everything. It has a pool. It has a fucking fitness center. Get breakfast from 6 a.m. to uh 10 so a lot of great fucking benefits with this hotel man like i said only 108 dollars for the weekend you can't beat that shit I, of course i did use trivago.com yo trivago.com that shit works man that's what's up i'm definitely gonna use them again next time we're trying to uh, get us the hotel but we're saying uh, well we're not in something as big as this but the hotel we're in is pretty damn nice all right enough red light talk hello Man, I hate that I missed out on um, going to the bar last night with Sub D and them. Shade Tree, Sub D, uh, Z, and a bunch of other guys and stuff. They went to um, the L House over here that's literally like five minutes away from the hotel I stay in. That's what they went last night for the little after party type stuff, man. And I couldn't go with them. 
because I promised my wife I'd take her out to dinner or wherever she wanted to go because I was out a lot longer than I was supposed to be. So because of that, because I didn't leave the expo and stuff, now she get back home to her until after seven. I told her I'd make it up to her by taking her to whatever restaurant she wanted to go to. And we went, dude, we went to this place called Ponderosa. Um, I don't remember the rest of it, but I know it's called Ponderosa or Panderosa, something like that. Yo, that place was fucking delicious, son. It was a it was a fucking steakhouse that included an all-you-can-eat buffet. So what, what would happen is you would go in, they have a bunch of items posted up on the wall. It's like a bunch of menu items, you can see pictures of them and everything, right? You go in, you order your entrees. You order your entrees and your drinks right there at the front counter. So so then the, uh, the server takes you to your seat. You go, you sit down, they bring you your drinks, and then you have all unlimited access to the buffet. The buffet stuff is not your typical type of buffet. It's like it's like a big it's like a big salad bar with a bunch of extras, right? So of course you got your salad section, you got your dessert section. They had all kinds of fucking cakes, ice creams, yogurts, and stuff there too. Uh, motherfucking uh, pastas. We had hot pasta, cold pasta, spaghetti, meatballs. Shit, you can go in that you can go up in that bitch and make you some fucking tacos if you want to, son. They have tortillas, the fucking uh, was the uh, taco meat. <laughs> Uh, all your dressings, dude. They, they have fucking everything, man. So you go, you can eat as much as you want, breadsticks and all that stuff. There, they bring you your entree. You eat your entree. If your entree ain't enough, you just go back to and enjoy the damn buffet and stuff, man. Let me tell you something. That shit was that shit was nice. For me and my wife, uh, we we both ordered a special. The special was uh, the regular price on it was twenty four ninety nine, but they had a special for twenty ninety nine. So the both of us, we got that. That was the steak and lobster dinner. I got mine with French fries. She got hers with a baked potato. Yo, man, when I tell you that shit was real good. <laughs> that shit was fucking delicious, man. I would definitely go there again. Definitely, definitely, definitely. And next time we come up here, I, I really want to try a bunch of other places too. Oh, green light. There we go. <laughs> Slightly twisted roads over here, you know, nothing major. Oh, should be bum. Yagada! This is the Orange County Convention Center. This is where the expo is being held at. All of this is a damn convention center. This shit is big as fuck, son. Yeet! <laughs> I, look, I don't understand the boy from stairs. So we out to the grass and stuff, like, really? Uh, Our right, warehouse deliveries and stuff right there, obviously. Yeet! Showing up on the uh, bus, shuttle buses and shit. Bitch, fuck that son. I know I'm to live. I'm to live. Good morning. I'm to live. Oh, God, God, God. Morning, morning, morning. I know I'm not the first bike here. I know there's the motorcycles are probably piled in over there already because. Just like me, people probably gotta check out their hotels about 11 a.m. So they want to get here as early as they can to get into some demo rides. And, uh, I see the most like areas. Uh, I can't see any bikes yet. Uh, okay, I see a few bikes. Yes, I see a few bikes over there already. But the demo rides don't even start till nine. So I'm here at least half an hour early. Like I said, man, I want to make sure I can ride some. They got fucking four wheelers and dirt bikes and stuff over here. They got a little MX, uh, yeah, a little motocross type track that they made up and stuff. They got a bunch of ramps and shit over there that you can ride up and down on the go karts and the uh, and the carts. I, I forget what the um, not go karts, bitch. Fucking dirt bikes and uh, yeah, you 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 could call them go karts. I know. dollars all day 25 on large vehicles no re-entries now so that's the regular rate for parking over here most i just get to park for free though son
Just because you directed me to park down here, I'll park down here. Otherwise, I was just going to you know, get in where I can fit in. Get boxed in, this will be an exit here, so yeah. I'm just here today for the demo ride, so I didn't get to do a single one yesterday. Well, good. If you get here early, sign up. I guess you know where everything is. Yes, sir. <laughs> hey, uh, uh hmm? problem, man. You want to ride your bike over there, park it, and you'll be over there all day. That's fine. Yeah, that'll work. Cool. I didn't tell you that, though. <laughs> Yeah, park my bike over there by the uh, demo ride location. Is that a rope? Yeah, that's a rope. And you said put B, where it? Huh? Where you want me to put a B at? No, we'll put a B. Oh, all right. That's just so we you know what to look for when you come back. We don't spend all day or worry about where where it went to. Just hold that and we'll know right. it's a bag. All right. Oh, uh, I think they close at like five, so we gotta look at look in, look in the, the, the book right there. Yeah. Well, don't worry. We're 30 minutes after closing time, just to right now. We'll find the time, but just to let you know, we're yeah. here 30 minutes after closing. So yeah. I'll be here that late. Yep. Yeah. Who comes this early? I'm not here that late. Exactly. Make sure they understand. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. Thank you. I guess I'll start by testing the BMW. <laughs> Thank you.